Well, the city of Sacramento is still very much buzzing from Lady Bird's Academy Award nominations. And now you can experience all the landmarks featured in the film. Dina Kupfer is in Sacramento with one of the stops. So you can now enjoy some of the sites that were featured in the film Lady Bird, the iconic Sacramento-based film. Of course, Greta Gerwig, the director from Sacramento, wanted to really show off her city. And this blue house is one of the most iconic spots in the film. I've got Jen here, and she's with Sac Running Tours. You started a running and walking tour to be able to feature some of these places around East Sac. Why do something like this? I mean, the, La the Lady Bird movie was enchanting, but Sacramento is enchanting in itself. And so just to be able to show that to people in East Sacramento is you know, really exciting. It is. And tell me more about this house because this is a pretty special house, too. It is. Yeah, it was built in 1922 and it's historic. It's the only East Sacramento residence that is on the Sacramento Register of Historic and Cultural Resources. Wow. So, and it was um, December uh, 2014 is when it was listed there. So, okay. um, it's really interesting house. It <laughs> is. And she has so many more facts. She goes through uh, the Club Raven and then McKinley Park, of course, with the Rose Garden, which was also featured in the film. So, if you want to get in touch with Jen, website? Yes, yeah, Sac Running Tours.com. There you go. And then make sure that you get out and enjoy some of these beautiful spots all around Sacramento. Oh, such a fantastic tour for great movies.